super happy, but she just hates the car. Like, she just doesn't like it. I can get about 10 minutes out of her. He's gonna laugh, he's gonna laugh. On my way! I actually can't believe it. Looks amazing. I'm not even oh, gonna I'm getting everything. I'm zoom getting everything. in on the product. Look at these, these are... Yeah. yeah. Mate, lemonade. Hey, wait. Oh, it's so American, it's so cool. Look at them, they actually hold... What do I mean, you think? every other animal here smiles, <laughs> except the cat. Think? Do you ever put your hair up and then just always leave a little bit there? Hello honeys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're just joining me now, then I've probably got loads of food in my teeth. Let me just check. Okay, so I'm so excited for this video because I get to go to this most amazing garden center, but also I'm showing you a before and after of the garden. We have done, we've literally transformed the garden like you're not going to believe. But also it's not the complete finished product, but I'm gonna show you the before and after of where we're at now. We've only got a couple of bits to do, like a bit of decking, maybe a pergola, a barbecue area, but I'm so excited for you to see. Lots of new bits I've bought for an alia for holiday bits. I've got such exciting updates in this vlog. So yeah, weekly vlog comes to the garden center with me, get some new purchases. Hope you love this video. Definitely stay tuned. Please subscribe if you're new here. I'd be so grateful and I love you guys and hope you enjoyed this video. I want to show you some little outfits, some cute outfits that she's bits from Kidley. I want to show you to look. Little dresses, they're so cute. But this is my favorite outfit. Look at this one. Look at this one. It is so cute. I actually can't quite cope. Look at the ruffles and the little zip at the back. I actually can't cope. Come swim with us. It's a little swim outfit, SPF 50. Look at it, it's actually beautiful. Little towel dress here, cute for the summer just to put on. Some little joggers for the sweet girl. And then another little green dress and a matchy and same one in cream. But I want to show you this. I'm gonna actually put this in her nursery because she only goes to sleep in her nursery and sometimes she cries when she goes in there because she's like, she knows she's going to sleep. So I kind of wanted to put some toys up there with her so that we can play in there in the daytime so that she knows that's her room. She's got some place, place to play. So we got this from Kidley. I'm so excited for it because look, can you see? Look, you've got, so that's three years, isn't it? Yeah, it goes up three years, but you've got the table bit there, but also you can take it off and she can play with it. I just feel like this will be perfect. Look, it is so gorge. The clever composer table. Magic Touch technology introduces 20 instruments, instruments with one tap. Three language options, English, Spanish, and French. Little musicians can layer and mix instruments with freestyle mode. Silly mode adds entertainment with four fun sound banks. LED light rings stimulates eye tracking and encourages color exploration. Grows a baby with removable, le removable legs for standing or sitting. And wooden surface easily wipes clean. So I'm gonna put that in her nursery because I feel like that will just be so cute. Angels, I don't know if I told you, but we've actually been struggling with Renalia's high chair. So I've swapped to this one. This is the stocky. Um, I got it in black oak and I've heard so many amazing things about this. So this is the trip trap um, and it's a Scandinavian design and I honestly have heard the most amazing things. I got it in black oak, um, but it grows with the baby. So you can have it from birth and then you can have it from six months, that part, and then you have it for life. Like it's absolutely miraculous. So I got that one in black. I got this one, the tray, but you don't really need to use it. Loads of you suggested the high chair. Um, but the trip trap's meant to be unbelievable because what they suggest is, the stocky, is that they're saying that they promote a healthy environment, a healthy growth for your child. So from the very beginning, when they start eating, they are at eye level with you when you're eating, when they're eating, and it promotes a really healthy environment for children and babies around eating. And I think that's so amazing. And we love our little bug. I feel like I wanted a high chair that actually just goes to the table and they can have so much more of a good environment at the table. And apparently they're such good products that they last so well. Obviously they do, because the Scandinavian designs, they just win, don't they? And it'll just be so nice that when we're at the dinner table, she can eat with us. Because especially with baby dead weaning, they need to be able to be a bit more free. They need to be by the table. They need to be able to be really, you know, watching mum and daddy. I hope I'm saying it right. Stocker or stocky? Stocker. Whatever it is, I'm very, very buzzing, because a lot of my friends, especially Charlotte, Charlotte Sterling Reed on Instagram, I've called her my friend now, she's just helping me a lot, but she's SR Nutrition on Instagram, and she's recommended them. She just said it really brings them into the heart of the home, and it's just really important for them to be at the dinner table with you, um, and learning healthy habits. Danny's putting the trip trap together, look at it so far. I don't know if Spencer updated you about the finished product of the garden. Oh, look, oh, it's a bit brisk out here this morning. Wow, look at this. They did this all in a day. They rotivated it, they got rid of the shed. Like they literally did this all in a day. I can't actually quite believe it. It's ready for turf. Oh, it's such a fresh morning out here, it's so nice. And look, all of this around the side as well, the bricks need to go. Spencer's gotta go and get stuff, rid of stuff at the, um, at the tip, but I actually can't believe it. 
looks amazing. Oh, by the way, don't talk to me about this. I left a little bit of, um, like, the chicken cut-offs where we made chicken nuggets. Oh, my God. The seagulls were tapping on the door trying to get in the house because they wanted that chicken from that bin. Never seen anything like it in my life, in my whole entire life. For about 45 minutes, the seagulls were going crazy. They woke me up. It was like five o'clock in the morning. But anyway, look, so exciting. I'm just making Renalia some cheese biscuits in the air fryer. So I've just taken some ground almonds here. And then I've taken some Cathedral City cheese. And oh, one's fallen off, but they're just going to be, oh, they've all fallen together. Wonderful. But they're just going to be little round little biscuits. They're not completely round, but they will be nice. Trust me, trust the process. So Spencer absolutely loves her cheese biscuits. Oh yeah, can I have another one? Yeah, of course, he absolutely loves them. He says they're better than any cheese straw he's ever had. Mm -hmm. Do you love them? In the air fryer as well? Have you got these from any bakery? Oh my God. Really? Oh, yeah. And this is coming together. Look at this, this is looking brilliant. Angels, he has put the chair together and it looks so cute oh my god i love it but wait you don't even know about this point yet look at what it says on the back horton i love it i love this chair i feel like it's the perfect height it's so nice spencer well done putting it together i did actually get two more of these tidy top bibs i've got a bibardo one but these ones are more affordable and i love the print so she's got the heart and the watermelon the strawberries and the fruit Full coverage bib, sticks to any smooth surface, catches mess and spills and works with high chairs. So, love that. She's gonna have steak tonight. Hello. Which helps, uh, get rid of the old Is that teeth. nice for the teeth? You're having steak with a bit garlic, of garlic. Garlic could be good for the teeth as well. In your new high chair with your new bib mummy bought. Is that nice? Clever. You want some cauliflower and some pasta now? Oh, Christ. Mmm. Very too coarse dinner for now. Oh. Oh. Oi. So, Grandad, I like my steak. Let's do this. And it's wow. not raining. We've got a little side garden around here, which we're very grateful for. And then we've got no one next to us this side, which we're really grateful for as well. And then this is the beautiful big garden. So, when we first actually came to see it round, we were told that that was next doors, but it's not. So, we're grateful for that. We've got a little apple tree back here. We've got a big tree there, which we're going to look at trimming back and then we've got another shed over there which i don't even know what's in it oh my god no i don't want to go in it baby there's a little lock on it yeah, it's not safe, no you can't see it oh my god i love you baby baby oh, sorry, that lock, yeah that. i love you no thank you absolutely not is the lawnmower in there absolutely not oh my god, oh my god absolutely not absolutely not so then we've got another little tree there another little tree there and then inside there i don't know what that is i do not know what that is there we go though here we go another little shed don't want to know what's in there how do we get rid of sheds down. yeah lovely and then we go around the back here and we've got the side bit so that's amazing my baby wants to go into all the sheds <laughs> oh my goodness no baby what's going on no i don't want to go in there sorry absolutely not sorry absolutely not <laughs> but i love the fact we've got a garden we've got paving we've got a garden we've got trees we've got space we've got a garden we've got a garden here we go then angels let's oh i've locked the door i am absolutely wow it's windy but i don't care i can't believe we've got grass i actually can't believe we've got grass it is windy oh my god it's really windy i've got something in my eye that's absolutely fine there we go, I've got the thing out of my eye. I can't even believe this is our garden. Like, honestly, obviously there's so much more to do. Um, we are gonna, I'll talk you through what we're gonna do now. Spence might be better off talking you through it, but I'll show you what we've done in the garden. Obviously I'm gonna do a before and after as well, but I actually can't quite cope with this. So here is where the decking area is gonna go, because they were gonna continue the grass on here. Um, but actually we just sold some of it on Facebook Marketplace for really cheap, the extra rolls that we did get. Um, but we're gonna put a bit of decking here because we think it'd be really nice because then you've got that and then you've got the decking area which you could have like a swing chair on or something. And then it just breaks up the garden. We need to do like a feature plant actually next door. Our neighbors, they're amazing in their garden. And they suggested to get a plant at the end, like a feature plant to hide that tree stump that we got removed. Um, over here, we're gonna have um, like the barbecue area. I mean, I feel like it's gonna look so nice. We need to match in the 
back um, fence because this is a nice fence this is a nice fence but we need to match the back fence in um, but I'm absolutely besotted with it like I actually can't quite cope with it obviously this stuff's gonna go and here obviously we've got the um, fence we've got the shed there spent support himself a little wheel wheelbarrow but they did so much in one day they got this all laid in one day like I just think it's amazing and they did the trellis bit round there but I just can't believe this is our garden like it feels so amazing that like we can't go on it for another month I think it has to set Spencer's like I've got so much maintenance to do for it but it's incredible and I just feel like we're so lucky that we get to have this garden because it's a little sun trap we're just really obviously it's windy right now but it just feels amazing that we're going to be able to have you know time with Renadia here and this is the house where Renadia was made so it's a really special house for us um cringy as it may sound it really is so yeah I'm going to show you a big panel of the garden now because I feel like you can then see it all really like really well. Anyone can eat these by the way. I love these. So I'm just gonna take some courgettes. I've got some, I haven't got any normal flour so I need to get some gluten, gluten pal flour. Um, she's gonna have the plain white flour here. I've got these little breadcrumbs. I need to get the panko breadcrumbs but there's a little bit of salt in them but nothing that she's not allowed. So that's possible. Dip it into the flour, dust off the excess flour, dip it in the egg. I'm gonna put a tiny bit of garlic on some of these and then I'm just gonna put it in the breadcrumbs. And then I'm just gonna put them in the air fryer, spray them with a little bit of oil. They will be nice, I promise. She hasn't been that keen on cauliflower. We've tried her with it twice now. So I'm gonna do some of these with cauliflower as well because I don't wanna waste the egg. What do you think? I've dipped them in a little bit of yogurt with some chopped tomatoes and a bit of paprika. Nice. What do you prefer, courgette or? Oh. Mmm. Well, we make the best food. Thank you. Clap a girl. Big chewing girl. Oh my love. I'm also very excited by the way we're trying, we're going to put this upstairs in the loft I think this. We've got the bag of Smith's toys that we still haven't got back but we never actually used that. Um, we never actually used that product really because Renalia didn't like sleeping in a bassinet, especially not downstairs. I got this as well um, from Dunelm because Renalia's nursery is nearly finished. We haven't got anything on the walls yet though. We need to put some stuff on the walls but we haven't put anything on the walls but Basically we have a small window and a double window and the double window has the blackout curtains but the small window doesn't have anything yet. Um, it just has like one of those cheap blackout curtains from Amazon which we're going to take on holiday with us which is so good. Um, so I got this one so my dad's going to put this up this week so then I can show you the nursery. Obviously it's not completed the nursery because we haven't got any like cute wall hanging decks but yeah it's basically finished so I really want to show you it. Um, I don't want to hype it up too much but I really love it. I love the space in the nursery. But yeah I got this one so dad can put the other Dunelm curtains we got on. I'll show you the curtains I've got. Basically we want to go on holiday and when we go on holiday I don't think we're going to take our pram away with us because our pram's really heavy and you can't fit it in the overhead storage. So everyone told me to get the baby zen yo-yo. So I went on to Pram World. Oh my God, Win Stanley's Pram World. Oh my God, they are the most helpful people um, I've ever spoken to in my life. I was really lucky that one of the girls there is actually my subscriber and she was so helpful. She knew everything about everything, about every pram, about every car seat. Because I'm having a bit of a nightmare at the moment with the Cybex car seat. And I don't know whether it's the car seat or it's just Renalia hating the car. Um, but basically... I was gonna get the Joey car seat and swap it out, but because everyone said to me like, but someone said to me, why don't you get a professional to look over the Cybex car seat to see if you've got it correct and everything's correct? Because sometimes there might be a minor tweak and it might make her happy, but she just hates the car. Like she just doesn't like it. I can get about 10 minutes out of her um, and that's it. I really can't get much out of her. If we do, I have to get things on the iPad and have to do things like that and that's boring for her. And you know, I'm, I just, yeah. So we wanna go on long car journeys because we wanna go, a, away soon in the UK as well. We wanna just go to the Cotswolds or something and take her to like the wildlife park and just have a nice little stay. But yeah, we're a bit limited at the moment. But back to that, I've got the babies in yo-yo. I'm so excited. Um, the boys are out watching football at the moment. It's just me and Renalia. Renalia's asleep upstairs. And I think I'm gonna put it together because I'm so excited. So I've got it all in black. I'll show you. I've got the car seat adapters. Um, I'm so excited. I've got the, pa the parasol. I'm gonna take this on holiday with me. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so, so, so excited, like legit buzzing. I can't believe it. My friend from London, she was like, oh, don't get the big prams because, okay, it's nice to have the bassinet, but you'll just need something that's, you know, maneuverable and easy and etc. I wanted to get the doona because everyone said the doona is really good. But when you go abroad, when you get like to the airport and you get an airport transfer, do you have to call them beforehand? And because you can't just get a taxi, can you, when you need a baby and a car seat? So could I, do, do I just have to book an airport trans transfer and say, can I have a car seat in the car? Because we're not going to take a car seat away with us. But we're just waiting for our passport to come back. But I'm so excited. Oh, sorry, I know it might not look much, but this is a small win for me. 
I put it all together myself in like 10 minutes. Now I'm gonna say about 20, but I still did it myself. And I know it might not look much, but there was a lot of Velcroing things to do and threading things through. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to thread it through differently because I don't know what size exactly she'd be in it, but. Oh my God, I actually did it. Look at it. I love it. Oh my God, it's so nice. I actually did it myself. Had to thread all this stuff through. Had to get it all right. You can't sit them up in it, can you? Is that it? Is that them lying down? That's it, they can't sit up. Like there's no way of them sitting up or lying back. They just have one specific mode. I love it, Hans. Look at it, it's so lightweight. It's brilliant. Oh my God, get me on holiday. Hello, beautiful angels. It is time for dinner, but it's also time for Anelia to nearly go to sleep. I'm gonna take her upstairs and read some stories, aren't I? It's bedtime now. Tonight, my sous chef is, well actually no, the main chef, I'm the sous chef. We are gonna be having this Hello Fresh meal. This is the North Indian style cauliflower and lentil dal. Lovely. Beautiful. We actually love these meals because when I'm editing or when I'm putting Renalia to sleep or when I'm doing different things, it's hard sometimes coming up with meals with a family, with working from home and just in general, I don't know about you guys, but I find it so hard to always come up with meals. I take my hats off to my mum and dad for always coming up with new meals, but HelloFresh is really good because, what, you, you want to come around and speak about HelloFresh? Okay, that's fine. They come already prepared. There's no waste. It's really good. So There's I'll show you this. Always new recipes. Always new recipes, yeah. yeah. I just think they're brilliant. They're not just convenient, but they're also healthy. They're lovely. They're easy to cook. I mean, I'm saying now the Spencer's cooking no, I enjoy it. doing it, to be fair. He so does. It's, like, it's really well structured. It's a new so. little hobby, isn't it, cooking? Absolutely. I think we make the dream team. Yeah. Say goodnight to your girl, then while you cook. We love you. Nice. Mm -hmm. Spence has absolutely cooked us up a treat. Hugo's having it. What do you think, Hugh? Unreal. Unreal. So exciting. Okay, let me have a go then. Mmm. Oh my god. Spence, that's unbelievable. Honestly, I love HelloFresh. If you want to go and use my discount code, you can. Cheers to me saying the wrong code. It's actually Hello Imogen 50 for 50% off your first order and 35% off your next three. Use the code. My mum always uses my code. I love it. I always use my code afterwards as well. I just find them so good for the family. This is two of our five a day. Every week you get 37 recipes to choose from, which I think is brilliant. There's so much variety on there. Mmm. Enjoy. Like it, baby boy? I'll be going back for seconds. Hugo's going back for seconds. Me too. Oh, so. Unreal. Yeah, We're just talking about birthday yeah, plans for Hugo. So here we are, the fam. We are all at this massive, it's a bit sunny, but it's amazing. Not complaining. Look at this. We've driven. Apparently it's got so much. Look Three at the joker. Two trees. We're going to sell you here. Oh, yeah. Look at these yeah. two, I can't yeah. cope. I am so excited. Look at the size. Oh, cool. um, oh yeah. my God. Yeah. <laughs> the trolley's tiny. This is massive. I've driven half an hour to get to here, so it better be good. Fingers crossed, fellas. Are you having fun? Are you? In your okay. new pram, you're Wait, so sweet. Oh, Wait, shut up. Look at everything here. I'm so excited. Oh, look at these. Faux bouquet, 39.99. They're nice, aren't they? Look at Dad, thinks he's Mr. Gardener. I can't quite cope. All I'm here for is the food. There's a whole free from section. Oh, we need one of these. We nearly loved it. For your little barbecue area. I can't wait for the barbies. I'm so excited. I don't think this will be the best place <laughs> to get beautiful things. Beautiful hair. Thank you, sweetie. Oh. Oh. No, he hasn't eaten. Oh so my me. God. What take, can we do with him? Hugo B, can you push for Nelia, please, Angel? Look Careful around the shiner. At all this food. I mean, I can't have some of this, but you need oh, to get, get the carrot cake. You need to get the carrot cake. Look at these salted caramel worlds. Oh my god, what mm. I would do. Oh, baby, look at all the dining stuff. We're going to go over to that as well. Oh, god, how nice. We have is a nice it here? afternoon in here, by the way. Limon. Oh my god, come show them all this. Guys, I'm getting way too excited. Look at the restaurant. Are they going to the restaurant? They're going to go and eat there? Yeah. Baked potato. Oh my god, I feel like I'm on holiday, don't you, Spence? I feel like I'm on holiday. Yeah, so I'm chewing my sweet. Look at the big slabs. I'm going for hard sweets. Okay, can we Nanny just... Joy, that is you. Really, does she love them? She always Should has these sort of hard her? sweets. Should mm. we get some for her and take them down? Yeah, I will. We're going to see your No, friends. I might take her teeth out now. Look, Bless look, her. Look, look, look. Vegan. Look, 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 look. Chocolate fudge. Dark chocolate, wow. honey, ho honey home, uh, honey home, honey home, vanilla fudge. Spencer, we are going in. Okay, wait for the haul at the I'm end of this in. video. I'm getting so, so into your face, you won't even know. Oh my God, what are these? Come chocolate on then. chip and sea salt brownie crisps. We've had those before. I'm not even gonna. They're not that flavor. I'm not even oh, gonna. I'm getting everything. Ooh. I'm getting Zoom everything. In on 
Look at these, these are just, cute. Just a side face. Caramel and milk drinking chocolate. Obviously, I can't Lovely. get those, but. Spence, look at these tiny little hazelnut chocolates. Oh my god, there is everything. Spiced apple and dark chocolate biscuits. Wheat flour in them. Look at Frank's. Don't know who Frank is, but oh look, there's my little honeybees. Angels. I cannot. Dad, look at these flapjack things. Dad's just giving Hugo some money to go and get some food. The bank of mum and dad, yeah, Hugues? He's a joker. Oh my god, look at all the jams. I wonder if they have blackberry jam. Nowhere ever has blackberry jam, marmalade. What's the difference between marmalade and jam? Dad, what's the difference between marmalade and jam? I know. What? It's the citrus peel and the marmalade. Really? That's what makes it. Cool. They still don't have blue blackberry jam. They don't. Look at these. Look at these crisps. Oh my god, they've got every single nut, pistachio. Look at all of that over there, guys. I want to go over there. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Sweet beetroot relish. That is me. Plowman's chutney. Mrs. Bridges. These are really cute, aren't they? Farmhouse chutney. Beetroot and red onion chutney. That's a bit of me. Chili jam. Spencer loves a chili jam. Oh, what are these? Have they got wheat in them? Yeah, they have. Oh my god, guys, this is so cute. Gourmet burger sauce. Guys, can you see everything? Is anything sticking out to you? I'm literally obsessed with all this stuff. I just think it looks so cool. Right, we've got the big cakes over here that I can't have, but Spencer's gonna go in. We've got all of the drinks down there. We love all of those drinks. Um, we've got more bits here. Look, look, look. Sticky rib yeah, wing I sauce. Like look. Beetroot and red onion chutney, I'd like. Chili jam, you need to get a chili jam from the garden center. This is Bridges. You have to. Oh my God, what's this? The squidgy thing. Right. We're getting one. You do know we're getting one. We've got, oh, sorry. We've got to get one. It's made of silicon. It's resistant. Spence. Oh, yes. Should we get two? I think your dad's got some of these. Has he? Yeah. Should we get two? Yeah, why not? Two greens or two blues? Greens. Greens, two greens. Should we get a basket? Oh my god, look at these. Need to, aren't we? Look at Matey selling them to me. This is American shopping channels, isn't it? They just sell you everything. Oh, they've got big dishes here. Oh my god, Hans, look at all the mugs. I can't cope with it all. You know I can't cope with it all. Oh my god. Angels, they've got such nice, beautiful homeware. Look at these down here. That's beautiful, those twisted candles. I want some black ones of those. I've got two, but I need another one. Look at all of these. Guys, this is actually such a nice garden centre. I've never been to a garden centre like this and I've always wanted to go to a big garden centre so I thought, why not make the journey stay? Oh my God, they've got such, that's such a nice vase, isn't it? Slightly more expensive than the range, but it's absolutely fine, we move. They've got such nice bits. Oh my God, they've got so much stuff, guys. I'm gonna get Renalia something in here. I feel like there'll be something for Renalia in here, so I'm really, really excited. I don't know where everyone's gone. I think Spencer's gone to get. Ah, oh, there he is. There he is. I said a basket, but you. Okay, why? Spencer wants me to get a photo here, so people think he's on holiday. I can't cope. Okay, my love. Oh, the dog's on holiday with us. This is a beautiful little area. Look at this. That's a lovely vase, isn't it? Look at this. Oh, but that's a nice vase as well down there. We've got everything, Hans. Oh, there's the fam. Hello, cheeky chicken. Hello. What do you get? Chili brie. Oh my god. My older brother would love this place. Oh, no, not a cat. <laughs> Granddad's gonna get her a cat. Why not make one that smiles? Yeah, I know, they look. What do you mean, think? Every other animal here smiles, <laughs> except think? the cat. Every look at smiles. all of this. Look, my older brother would literally here. love it. Look at these elephants, though. Oh, this is beautiful. I am my best pet. These are lovely books. Oh, they've got jelly cats. They've got jelly cats, guys. Oh, they are jelly cats. Cats smiling. The other one doesn't want to live. Look, oh, look. I'm going to get her a nice book, I think. Oh, sorry. Mind the babe. Oh, she likes to wear spot. This is more of her, isn't it? What about a noisy book? Noisy animal search and find. Oh, my God. Stop. Noisy tractor. Let me see what she likes. I'm going to have a little... Oh my God, there is so much stuff here. You're never gonna find her name. Oh, whatever. You found Renalia. Yeah, whatever. 
Just change the letters. Yeah. Wait, put it with this. Layla. Jacob's actually there. Can you remember a time when Jacob was never there? Me and Jacob's names were never available. Is Hugo's there? Imogen's there. Oh my God, Dad, do you remember? When our names used to be quite rare. Hugo's oh, name isn't there. Oh, Eat Angel. Why have I bought it? So I tried to go for the tuna and spent to wait for the Oh god, can you hear him in the background? The jungle stacking ring, that's quite nice. One to two years. Let's see. Oh, there's loads of puzzles. Oh, I love puzzles. Oh, guys, this is really nice. I feel like I'm gonna wait for Spencer and I'll choose a book with him so we can give it to Renalia from both of us. Or we could get one each, couldn't we? So, my auntie got us this for before when Renalia was born. Um, and they're really cool books. They're black and... No, they're not black and white, but they're like um, sort of old school drawings. They're all about little people, big dreams. So when amazing, inspirational people like Rosa Parks, Michelle Obama, Dolly Parton, Melia Earhart, Nelson Mandela, when they were all young, it was about how they had the dreams and how they became to, you know, be who they are now. I'm a little sucker for all these creative products. Look, cool touch ice towel, instantly cools when wet. Look at all these little things, stretchy pocket belt, window bird feeder, look at all of this. Look at all the, oh no, the, oh no. I'm in with the candles now, Hans. What am I meant to do with all the candles? I don't know what I'm gonna do myself. I can't quite cope. Oh, they sell Neil's Yard here. Angels, I'm not sure I can cope with all this. They've got Dr. Ho... I can't say that word. Na ha Hoshka. Oh, they've got all the faith in nature stuff. Actually, Spencer does want... Oh, Spence, do you want one of these soap bars, baby? Oh, what are these? Makeup removing cloths. Do I need them? Probably not. Am I going to get them? Yes. So it's what showed a vlog. So look, we're going to say bye to everybody. And bye. <laughs> Come back! Aww. You could get such lovely little gifts from here, couldn't you? Look at these. It's a lovely little tea bag holder, isn't it? This is stunning. Oh, look, we've got some licorice fudge. Oh my god, my mum loves licorice, but not fudge, I don't think. Yeah, baby. Oh, I love these, the penguin stuff. Okay, so I've just found these, and oh my goodness. My mum used to buy me Palmer Violets when I was younger. I know what you're thinking, I've got a lemon. Is it a lemon tree? Yeah. You gotta get it. Gotta get it. Yeah. Mate, lemonade. Hey, wait. Wait, smell this. Don't look at what it's called. Did you not look what it's called? So I'm just gonna make him smell this. Ready? Smell, tell me what that smells like. Um, Close your eyes. Close your eyes, see if Dad can get it first. Palmer violets. Well done. Of course, it's, I mean, really, yeah, I mean. How, how amazing, that's, I mean, that's so Palmer nice. Violet. Look at all my dried flowers. Fun fact, I spent 50 pounds on pampas grass. Um, I left it at my dad's while we were renovating and he just chucked yeah. it out. Come on, flip it. Show me. What does it say? In a world where you can be anything, be kind. Oh, I've just read that yeah. one. Yeah, yeah very people. true. If there's anything I can say to any of you lot. That... And what about that one, baby? If I lay here, if I just lay here. What band? Here. What band? Got three seconds. Three, two, one. Coldplay. Snow Patrol. Excellent. Okay, Angels, we've got to get these. We've got some bits in here actually at the moment. We're gonna get some more bits. Oh, I've got to get the giant strawberries. Oh, what about the, oh, fizzy cherry cola bottles, fizzy we dummies. Have gone to the it's we? nicer <laughs> here though, Dad. It's nicer here. Fizzy dummies, would you like? Giant straws, vegan. What about this one? Or should I get peanut butter flavor fudge, vanilla flavor fudge, chocolate fudge, dark chocolate honeycomb? Oh God. You know what they say though, don't you? I'll get a couple, Peanut. Spence. I'll get a couple. If you, if you pay peanuts, you just get monkeys. And watch his oh, face, watch yeah. his face. Look, he's so unhappy. That's the lie. Huh. Look at my Moody. Eye. I said Hugo says hi. Oh my, no, he's over there with the baby. Oh no, what is this? Lint dark chocolate spread. Please say you haven't got dairy in. Skimmed milk powder. Why, God? Why today? I got this one. I, he's gonna laugh, he's gonna laugh. On my way! I know, da, 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 da. They even have a pizza oven. Don't worry, I won't get you on. They have a pizza oven, oh my god, look at this. I can't quite cope with it. They've got everything. Look at all the cakes, I've got to show you the cakes. Almond croissant, apricot, danish, everything, look. Hugo actually got the vegan banana loaf, but I think it's got gluten in it. Look at the chocolate cake, look at everything. They've got everything. 
Wow, this is amazing, Nutella donut. Oh my God, so jealous. <laughs> she's having some apple and some cheese. She's already had car. No, what did she have today? She's had pasta, tuna and stuff. So I didn't think she'd want any more food. She's had two meals, but she's hungry apparently. She's had her cheese. If you, she sees you eat, I know. she wants booze. I've got my green tea, which was Imogen's, but now no, it's mine. mine. Yeah. <laughs> You like the apple? It's nice apple. That's the cheese, Spence, isn't it? Yeah, that's the cheese you just eaten. Oh, is that granddad? Hello, Bobby. Spence, Spence, these are for you. Mister. Every day I'm muscling. Huh. <laughs> so I'm going to do a little haul of what we got from the um, garden centre. First things first, shortbread rounds we're taking to Spencer's families. Um, Spencer also got fudge bites for the fam. Very cute. Pork crackling for himself. Coleman's. Oh, mighty mustard. Very granddad Peter Spence. The perfect crime puzzle book. Spencer was really interested in this. This was £9.99. It's basically like a mini, um, what is it? Like a, uh, what would you say? An escape room, I guess. We got this from my stepdad to say thank you for doing the garden. We've given him some beer and stuff, but he does love his old beer, so craft beer dictionary. I got these for myself, super good. Chocolate chip and sea salt brownie crisps. I'm gonna have to have one now and see what we're saying. I know I've had these before, but not this flavor. Do you remember when we went to Stoke Park, Spence? I got these from um, WH Smith, actually. Yeah. They're really, oh my God. Oh my God. They're like, literally, little crisps. Oh, dropping it everywhere. Okay. Look at, listen to what they actually do. Super strong and durable. No need to throw away sponges. Residue free, odorless and antibacterial. Scratch proof. Ideal for pots, pans, ovens and delicate materials. Flexible for cleaning inside glasses. Resistant to high temperatures because it can be used as an oven glove. Non-slip material. Perfect for unscrewing tight jars and containers. Removes soil from fruits and vegetables delicately and instantly. Electrostatic bristles attach and catch dust and hair and dishwasher safe. I actually can't quite cope with that, sorry. Right got two of them got these because they're the ogs these remind me of my mum fruit polos love them i got this book for anadia the gruffalo she needs a gruffalo and it's got little felt tabs how cute she'll love that she likes pulling them she tries to rip them off though or eat them these are meet your new best friend these cloths have all ability to remove all types of cosmetics including what was it including waterproof mascara without the use of harmful chemicals or synthetic makeup removers with just warm water oh my god I am so excited to try those. Hobbycraft was literally opposite craft. I got these six things from Hobbycraft. Look at them. They're so cute. You can put like veg and fruit in them. I just thought they were really nice. You could put little drinks in the, in the summer in them. Five pound for six. I think they're gonna be lovely to organize things in the fridge. I should have got more really, but Spencer says they're junk. Don't tell me we don't need these. Look how big these are. Four for eight pounds. Two pounds, two pound a jar. Two pounds a jar. Look at this, wait for this. How big can you get your iced coffee in there? Oh, it's so American, it's so cool. Look at them, they actually hold 24 ounces. 24 ounces, three cups, three cups in there. Iced coffee in the summer. All the little non-alcoholic strawberry dacks, don't worry about it. Very, very excited about all my purchases. Let me know if you think I got some good bits. Angels, I loved that video. What did you think? Hopefully you loved it. If you did, then make sure you subscribe and I will see you in my next video on Tuesday. I love you guys so much. Until next time, I'm gonna love you and I'm gonna leave you. Bye, angels, I love you.